Um, I'm done. I'm done. But you know it wouldn't be me if I did always really like that bass line. <laughs> I still do. It, it actually, and if you can imagine, it actually does get worse. It actually does get worse. You could not imagine how Molly could it get worse. It got worse. So, let's just go ahead and get into it. Please. Sorry for the multiple posts, but you guys have been so helpful. Definitely more than my family and friends in real life. I took your advice and met with my sister-in-law over lunch. She was very reluctant to give me any info, but here is what she said. Natalie is in no contact with her parents since before Kaya was born. She didn't lie about that part. I asked if she knew who Kaya's dad was because Natalie got upset every time I asked and refused to talk about him. She was surprised and said, you're kidding, right? You can't be this naive. It's obviously Ryan, her boss, the guy who owns the yoga place. I asked about their relationship. She kept saying, Natalie really loves you. I begged her to tell me everything. She said she thinks, not sure. The reason Natalie had an abortion was that she wasn't sure if the baby was mine or Ryan's. Either way, she didn't want another baby. I was floored. She was cheating on me? The same time we were trying for a baby? With the same guy who already abandoned her once? What is going on here? Why? I was stupid enough to start a college fund for her kid, yet she cheated on me at least once with this guy. I'm going to lose my house and half of everything. She said, listen, you are a good guy. Just move on. No need to dig more. You are making yourself crazy. Oh, no need to dig more means there's more to dig and uncover. I asked if Kaya knows who her dad is. She says, absolutely not, because Ryan has zero desire to be in her life. I want to tell everything to Kaya before leaving, but my parents think this is crossing the line because I'm not her dad or mom, and it's none of my business. My friends think I want to tell her the whole truth to hurt Natalie, but it's the opposite. I know how awful it is to be lied to, and Kaya deserves the truth. My parents think I act like a crazy person, and I should just meet with the lawyer. Wow. And, and that's it. I promise. That's Baby. it. Baby. How? how How bad does your, I don't know, self-esteem or your regard of yourself? I'm not sure exactly... <laughs> Raiden's still putting this yes sorry I know first up I'm still putting this shit all together holy so uh, the, yeah the time that you're trying for a baby and lying about it you're also effing around Guess what happens after F.A. F.O. You find out. I don't know if he could uh, go for any kind of custody. But that's a sister. That, that situation is so messed up. And I'm not sure if I'm reading into that one line, the I'm leaving. If, if I'm reading into him separating himself a bit from just everything. And that... I feel so bad for this daughter. I, I feel terrible for the guy. I feel terrible. For what he had to endure.
Das is a level of selfishness that you don't see very often. Oh, uh, what in the world is that? I'm leaving that picture up for Mama Har because it's the it's the equivalent of somebody that's putting their hands over their eyes, but they have their eyes one eye open and looking oh. through like they, they're a train wreck, but they don't really want to see it, but they can't help but see it. This is what this is. This is. I cannot believe somebody is this bad. Mm -hmm. I, I just really, really, really cannot believe somebody would treat somebody like this. With no remorse. And, and believe me, lady, I'm, I'm, I know I said what I said. You have no remorse. The only remorse you got is you got caught. That's your remorse. And again, you really mm -hmm. wouldn't have got caught because your sister knew about it and she only blurted it out because she got mad. So, came in late, just sped through the story, and two speed is crazy when the updates to the story are this speed. It, it really, and hello, Parker, but it, hey, 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 boy. It's, it's, it's when you have time after time. I am amazed myself. I like I said, I discovered Dusty is doing it now, too. Thank goodness. Um, when you get when we have done stories and we just give our you know give our analysis of it, but we really would like to know what happens, and then we come to the realization that we get updates on it, and we go, "Oh God, it's so much worse than the first story," and then we get a third story with, "Are you kidding me?" <laughs> Jeez. Oh. Oh. Uh. Did it say how long they have been together? Four or five years or something like that? Mm. I thought I remembered like something like seven years or. But how long was they married? If anybody right. knows that, please, let, please put it in the comments below. I appreciate it, but yeah. Um, Yep, upset she got caught. Yes. Huh? Yeah. Yes. That's, that's, that's really all this is. She's upset because, and, and let's be honest with you. I'm getting consequences. <laughs> that really is not true. Now that I think about it, that's not true. She didn't get caught. She got told on. And she got told on because little sister got mad. Well, big sister, it didn't say which one she was. Yeah. But sister got <laughs> mad. So she got she didn't get caught like the traditional aha I look through your phone or I followed you or the other person who <laughs> I'm just gonna sit here and make other people mad once again. So I, stuff keeps popping in my head. She's not with the dude that flat out don't even want anything to do with the daughter that is his. And your logic is you're gonna sleep with him again. Lady, you are. And you're not, you didn't take any precaution with him. You are a jerk of jerks, lady. Ooh, mm. You are a special kind of special lady. I'm sorry. You, you. Oh. Okay, I went back in the stream. They have been together for eight years, but married for four. So the daughter would have been four years old when they first got into a relationship. So the four-year-old daughter okay. who got pregnant with the whose father is the yoga instructor, who right. to OP's wife decided to sleep with him again, who decided to unalive the child. Because you didn't know if it was the yoga instructor baby or OP's baby, but it really didn't matter because, and, and I hate to even put that in the story. You didn't, you didn't get rid of the baby because 
she wasn't sure about it was the yoga instructor or OP baby. You got rid of the baby because you wanted to keep your body. That's the that's what you told OP. It didn't matter whose it was. You wanted to keep the baby because you wanted to keep your yoga body. That's that's the level of sick that lady welcome to the club of the worst wife of the year awards cause you are definitely in the running and I feel for anybody that's going to cover this one that <laughs> you're going to be hard to beat yeah. yeah let's put it that way you are really really going to be hard to beat 